Pirates have lost 10 straight games. They are 1-12, yeah. Pittsburgh Pirates. 10 straight losses, 1-12 their last 13, yet they're a favorite against a playoff-caliber Seattle Mariner team. <laughs> Why? Oh, Paul Skeens is on the mound. Wait a second. We yeah. can get Paul Skeens at minus $1.25. Oh, I'm so conflicted right now. Let's look at the total. <laughs> look, I think I think the under makes a lot of sense in this game. Under seven minus 125. Paul Skeens is lights out. He is a dominant phenom. We see a pitcher like this come around not every year and not every five years, not every 10 years. You know, it takes me back to my childhood in the mid-1980s, 1984, Doc Good and Dwight Good of the Mets. I think he finished with a 1.93 ERA. It was like 20 and four, one loss record. And he fizzled out. Uh, but he was a monster pitcher. And we see guys come up like this, and Skeens is the real deal. You know, everyone's like, well, the second time through, teams will get a feel for him. Keep in mind, his second start of the season was a rematch against the Cubs just six days later back in June, and he no-hit him for six innings. So uh, I do think the Mariners will struggle here. They're not familiar with Skeens. And um, the problem is I'm not looking to catch a falling knife with Pittsburgh off of 10 straight losses, 1-12 in their last 13. And Logan Gilbert, the starter for the Mariners, is having an excellent season as well. In fact, if you look at his numbers, uh, very close to Skeens. You know, we look at ERA. Both of these guys have a sub-3 ERA. Everyone knows Skeen, 2.25. Gilbert, 2.91 ERA. And he's coming off uh, a seven-inning shutout in his last start. In fact, his last two starts have come against National League opponents that aren't as familiar with them, the Mets and Phillies. One run allowed in 13 innings of work and only seven hits. I look for a pitcher dominant performance here. Not going to fade schemes, but I'm also not going to back a falling knife. So let's look at the total as a free play in this game. Mariners, Pirates, under seven, minus 125. And you mm. probably want to play it sooner than later because one of the leading indicator offshore books has already gone down to six and a half. So this line is not getting any higher. Mm. Very well could hit six and a half by tonight. Take a look at Pirates and Mariners under. Hopefully they get it in with a possible rain at 640 Eastern. And don't forget, I have a strong best bet tonight for my clients. Also, have a bonus free play right now on my page, Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. And you can get there quicker with that shortcut you see on your screen, wt.buzz slash sm. And while you're there, check out the fantastic offer. Buy three days and get seven. Seven days for the price of three works out to less than $10 a day. That's only about $5 a play for the next seven days and nights of all sports. MLB and any NFL preseason I have as well is included. And don't forget about those daily free plays once again on my page, Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. And while you're here on Wager Talk TV, thumbs up, like, click the bell for instant alerts when you subscribe because my Fade the Public and College Football Top 25 videos and NFL Fade the Public are right around the corner here in a couple weeks. And we're doing these daily free play videos for baseball and live shows and archive solo videos afterwards. So once again, click subscribe, hit the bell for instant alerts. And oh, yeah. Comment below because I read all the comments and I reply back right here on Wager Talk TV.